On behalf of Jews for Palestinian Right of Return and Labor for Palestine, and I want to just read something that Dr. Rima Najjar from Abu Dis in Palestine sent, and that we turned into a poster a few days ago. You can't really see the poster, but it, it's online. And what it says is, justice for, the, justice for the refugees at Yarmouk, Syria, safe passage back to Palestine, the homeland from which the Jewish state expelled them. And that's clearly what's already been addressed here. I won't belabor that point. But the importance of connecting the right of return, as well as opposition to both the Assad regime and ISIS, is all connected. As Amin said earlier, there would not be a Yarmouk if it was not for the Nakba. And we have to keep that in mind. And we, there would also not be an Assad regime if it was not for the Israeli regime that has tolerated it, tacitly tolerated it. If there would not be an ISIS if it had not been for the invasion of Iraq by the United States and the fomentation of sectarian violence and the wiping out of sectarian left. So we have to connect these issues, as we have to connect them also, as Amin pointed out earlier, to the Black Lives Movement in this country, because all struggles against oppression are connected, and that is the strength that we have. And from the, palace, from the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free.